Hey everyone, and in this video I want to speak about the barons I played in this cycle. It were 6 barons, almost 24 hours of play, very hard, but for me solo barons is the most interesting part in this game. It happened very rare, only one time per 2 month. So I chose to play as more barons as I could, and I took part in 4 very hard barons and 2 pretty easy without strong competition. Ok, let's start with the first group, here I piloted 5 Emperor Peace account on LH site in anti-solo helping Matty to win this baron. We faced 3 enemies, KW, Myth and SSQ. All of them were pushing Ace, but they didn't do it very hard. I mean they had only 1 or 2 anti-solo accounts, which is not enough to kick Matty from the base every time. And he got reinforcements more times than Ace, that is why they won. LH doesn't care about the troops, they can lose about 4 billion might for such baron, they play on pure tier 5, sometimes without even healing infirmaries. They had uh, here about 6 anti-solo accounts, 2 of them full Emperor piece, and of course to win LH in uh, solo Baron, playing solo, you need to pay a lot of money, it's very very expensive. So I think for them, for Myth plus SSQ plus KW, it would better to choose Rally Tactic because they had more rallies and I think they could make it with more tier 5 and this way I think they had more chances to win uh, LH because LH was playing alone and all their guilds were in Kingdom 710 when the other side had at least 3 uh, kingdoms. One kingdom is SSQ plus Doi, the second kingdom is KW, and the third kingdom is Myth. Uh, yeah, but to realize this tactic, I mean rally tactic, you need to play very good, all the rallies have to be coordinated in the voice call by the same person, but I think all these guys were not in the same call, so they had no chances to play like this. But rally tactic is very simple, you just not have to let enemy pushing person sit inside between rallies even 5 or 10 seconds, you just need to send one more rally when one of your rallies get kicked out from the base by LH. For example, XIX played the same tactic, I mean rally tactic against the uh, LAF, let me find this group, yeah, here I played on Basil's account, but I did nothing, because uh, nobody soloed, uh, XIX played only with rallies, they teamed up with BRR, and they had X2 more rallies than LAF, and LAF could do nothing against XIX, really, I saw this Baron, XIX totally dominated, and uh, the pushing person on LAF side got only, let me find him, only 8 plays, lacking case, but he trained a lot of mites, around 3.5 billion, he prepared a lot of tier 5, they had a very fast rain bot, they also got first 5 minutes, yeah, but they still lost. So against perfectly realized rally tactic, you can't do anything with x2 less rallies than the enemy. And also BRR plus XIX had a lot of strong rally leaders like this with full astrolite, but uh, the first place got by Buck, they were pushing him and he has mm, very low astrolite on his gear and only one 11k hero. Ok, let's back to the first group and I can say that anyway Ace did well. It was the first hard solo baron for him and for their family it is very good experience for future. I hope the next time they will try to beat LH again. That was very nice competition. Ok, let's go to another group where I piloted LH0 accounts, pushing person, and you see the time difference is very very big, like it was no competition in this group. But no, it was very hard, solo baron, enemy played till the end, they didn't give up, it was the second LAF group, they had very fast rain bots, they had very good anti-solo account, but we had around 3 anti-solo accounts, we totally dominated in solo, we also dominated in rally counts, but anyway here I lost around 1.3 billion mites, so it was very hard competition, I healed hospitals every time, so I didn't forget about this, and I played on tier 4 plus tier 5 battalions, because here was prepared only 2 million each tier 5. And this account is not very strong as I can say, because here is only one 11k hero, and here you can see is only cavalry gear tempered by astrolite, other mixes are not very strong like this, so I mainly use 208 comp, it work very, uh, very good. Okay, I think I can't say anything more about this Baron, 
We dominated everywhere in solo in rallies, so they just had no chances. Uh, better luck next time for them. And after this Baron I had only 15 minutes to prepare for the next, another very hard solo Baron where I piloted pushing person deep cyclone on 3v3 side. By the way, I didn't expect that the previous one will be very hard Baron, I thought that we will win after maybe 15 or 20 minutes and I will log in Cyclone account and have a lot of time to prepare. But uh, this Baron was an expected hard and I played all 4 hours, you can find entire video on my channel. Ok, let's talk about this, and here we got very hard solo competition at start, nobody got the first 5 mins, because around 15 accounts were soloing on pure tier 5 with leaders, and nobody had chances to get any reigns. It was 3 side Baron, B2W, RG and 3v3, maybe even 4 side Baron, because I saw Lunaraki was also prepared for solo, he soloed with leader, got very fast reigns few times, but I don't see him here in top 10. So seems he gave up or something goes wrong with uh, his time. Uh, yeah, the main enemies were of course RG family, plus gift. They had 12 rallies with very strong rally leads like this, like this. Rosex was their main pushing person, he has also full tempered gear, very strong accounts, but he got only 4th position in this top. And uh, this account is also very very strong. As you see, they chose rally tactic, their rallies were sitting inside for the long time, because after 20 minutes they understood that they have no chances to win us solo. We soloed very very well, very fast, with very fast reinforcements, and they were losing time. And after this they changed tactic, I think it was right decision, because they was catching us in time till the third hour. After third hour they risked a lot and did a lot of mistakes and they lost uh, maybe two minutes in a row while they had no rallies and we were sitting inside for free. Every time I tried to sit inside between the rallies even five or ten seconds, even two seconds, uh, I used uh, leaderless marches tier 4 plus tier 5, I lost around 1 billion might on this account, but I think uh, it worth it, of course it worth it, the time difference uh, very very big, uh, almost 5 minutes, and the second place unexpectedly got uh, K Pepsi Star, he was not a friend with uh, RG, he played on the third side, and uh, he was lucky to get the second place because he wasn't focused very hard by them, they um, focused only me when they had uh, their rallies ready. They used carpets very fast, they did it well, but um, I had a chance to uh, take time between their rallies. You can check also this recording on my channel, full 4 hours, it was very hard barren for us and for them also. But anyway, we won and uh, uh, thanks for the competition, that's all I can say to them. Ok, then I had 8 hours rest, I was sleeping, before our Baron, GBT family, we were pushing KDA, I was playing uh, first 2 hours on this account, then I went to sleep because we understood that we already won this Baron, no competition at all, we had only 4 enemy rallies who came just to get some scores, it was TWK, SGU and 2 more rallies, I don't remember their uh, names, tags. Ok, this Baron I played very easy way, I didn't take any rallies, I pulled on every enemy hit, and KDA have zero reports from this Baron, really, maybe they took rallies after I uh, went to sleep, I don't know, but um, when I played, I just pulled for every hit, and then we send another rally, for example Prada Tai with Blackwing, who go and kick out uh, enemy who is sitting inside. It was a very easy tactic, because no need to waste the troops for nothing, no need to catch enemies black wings. Just need to win, get uh, three positions, all the jewels, and that's all we need. And also this Baron was very boring for me, so I will not make a video from this Baron, and also the Baron I played the next, it was uh, XAX family, I already uh, told you some words about this, I did absolutely nothing on this Baron, I played uh, Basil's account, maybe only 5 solo hits, uh, something like this, against Lucky Case, and that hits uh, couldn't change here anything, because we totally dominating, I just watched this Baron, how they played with rallies, they played really well, 
and of course uh, the count of rallies and the uh, gear of rally leads was very strong and uh, LAF could do nothing against uh, this. And the last Baron I played in this cycle was the 13 group. It was the luckiest Baron I ever seen because just look, the time difference is uh, 1 second. Did you see this before? I remember one Baron with the same time difference where uh, Faijan uh, BFP played against KW, it was uh, maybe two years ago. I didn't take part in that Baron, it was very hard solo Baron as well, with the same difference in time. We started this Baron very good for us, we got first 5 mints, then we got reinforcements few more times, and after this LA started celebrating victory uh, too early. I think after 20 minutes they already uh, stopped playing so hard, uh, they was relaxing like just we already won and everything else. But the enemies concentrated, they changed the tactic, they stopped soloing and they started playing only with rallies. And then they got all our rallies wasted and after this enemy pushing person Mr. Kaka was sitting inside with a rally for 5 minutes for free and it happened several times. I don't know why LH played so bad with rallies. We had 6 rallies and we couldn't counter just one rally. Uh, once he took 3 rallies in a row with very fast changing of reinforcements because LH didn't find carpets for every rally. Some rallies were very very slow. And after 2 hours, the time difference was 10 minutes we were losing. Imagine losing with so good starts. So we needed to make a great comeback on the last 2 hours and we did it. We did it in solo battle because enemies changed back tactic to solo. I don't know why they did this because in solo mm, they did not so great like with rallies. I think they also started celebrating their victory early. They made a lot of mistakes in last 2 hours. They shouldn't play like that because they had no anti-solo accounts. He was playing solo alone. I mean this guy. And I was the only anti-solo on LH side. And I was kicking him every time. I had 100% win rate against this guy. I don't know why he chose uh, that bad comps, uh, because he was using pure tier 5 as well with the leader, but he lost all his solos. And in last one hour we got all the time back. Of course it was the luckiest win because everything could happen, but the timer showed us that we are winning by 15 seconds at the end. Uh, yeah, the time difference, <laughs> just one second, that's very funny. Uh, you can also find uh, the entire recording from this battle on my channel. I posted all of them already a few days ago. And I will do some highlights as well after a few days. So guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up. I wish you all the best and see you in the next video. Bye guys.